こんにちは、ゆうこ先生です。This is a lesson that I have prepared for my classes at the college that I'm teaching at.We use the textbook 元気 Volume 1 in our classes and then this lesson is from lesson 2.I mentioned a handout a few times in this lesson, but that's something that I have prepared for my students and it's not available for the public.Thank you for your understanding. If you are also taking a Japanese class at your school and use the same textbook, Genki, today's lesson will be useful for you to understand the key elements in lesson 2. Please also watch this lesson about ta form. It will help you to understand this lesson even better. If you are studying Japanese by yourself and are interested in purchasing this textbook on Amazon, Please go through the link that I have in the description below and support this channel without costing you anything. Also, I can hardly answer your questions here on YouTube. If you need my support to learn Japanese, please consider joining my online courses. You can find all the information about my Japanese courses in the description box below. Okay, let's begin the lesson. では、始めましょう。We have learned short past form or plain past form for Japanese verbs in the last lesson.Now let's learn plain past for adjectives and the nouns.Okay, so this is what we have learned so far.The conjugation for Japanese plain verbs. Just be careful with this particular one. あります in plain form, which is ある。ある conjugates like this. ある、ない、あった、なかった。Just be careful with this one, okay? We are going to cover this section of the handout today in this lesson. How to conjugate short form or plain form for e-adjective, n-adjective, and nouns. Let's begin with e-adjective. This one is easy as long as you remember the conjugation for e-adjectives in the long form. So back in lesson 5 last quarter, you learned how to conjugate e-adjectives into is, is not, was, was not, right? With the example of the adjective cute, かわいいです it goes like this. かわいいです。かわいくないです。かわいかったです。かわいくなかったです。What matters here is the ending. いいです。くないです。かったです。くなかったです。You apply these endings to conjugate any e-adjectives. So you have learned this much already in lesson 5. Now to convert them into the short form or plain form, this is what you have to do. Say you have the ending this for all of is, is not, was, was not, right? You simply drop them. That's all you have to do to come up with plain form for e adjectives. So, かわいいです becomes かわいい。かわいくないです becomes かわいくない。かわいかったです becomes かわいかった。And かわいくなかったです becomes かわいくなかった。So the conjugation for e-adjective plain form is very simple. As long as you know how to conjugate long forms, you simply drop this from the long form. And these two are the main theme in this lesson. The past plain form for e-adjectives was and was not. In the case of hot, 暑いです it conjugates like this. 暑い、暑くない、暑かっ
った。暑くなかった。And these two are the plain past. Was hot and it was not hot. We have two new e adjectives that we need to learn in lesson nine. One is young. 若い若い The other one is lonely. 寂しい寂しい Let's conjugate 若い in plain form together. 若い若くない若かった若くなかった若い若くない若かった若くなかった What about 寂しい Right 寂しい寂しくない寂しかった寂しくなかった。寂しい、寂しくない、寂しかった、寂しくなかった。So now you know how to conjugate e adjective in plain form, but as always, be careful with this one. Good, いいです。You still need to just drop the this from the long form, okay? So, e des in plain form conjugates like this. e, yo, ku, nai, yo, katta, yo, ku, nakatta. e, yo, ku, nai, yo, katta, yo, ku, nakatta. Now we are done with all the e adjectives. Let's move on to na adjectives. I hope you still remember how to conjugate na adjectives in the long form. Here's the example. Skina. So the na adjective skina conjugates like this. Ski des. Ski ja nai des. Ski deshita. Ski ja nakata. The conjugation of an adjective is quite different from e adjective. It has ja instead of ku for a negative form, and the past tense has deshita at the end instead of katta des. Now let's learn how to convert them into plain form. First of all, You do the same for the negative form as you did with e adjectives. You simply drop the des. So, suki ja nai des becomes suki ja nai. And, suki ja nakatta des becomes suki ja nakatta. But it's not so simple when it comes to the affirmative forms, is and was for n adjectives. The pleasant affirmative, des, becomes da for an adjective as we learned back in lesson 8. Now the past tense. To convert suki deshita into the plain past, this is what you have to do. Change deshita at the end to datta. Datta. So suki deshita becomes suki datta. Skidatta in plain form. Here is a new na adjective in lesson nine. Mean. Ijiwaru na. Ijiwaru na. When you conjugate ijiwaru na in plain form, it's going to be like this. Ijiwaru da. Ijiwaru ja nai. Ijiwaru だった。いじわるじゃなかった。いじわるだ。いじわるじゃない。いじわるだった。いじわるじゃなかった。Now we have completed the plain form conjugation for both groups, e-adjective 
and an adjective. Okay, let's quickly cover one more category. The plain form for nominal sentences, which is a combination of a noun and des, such as Nihonjin des or Gakse des. Here is good news for you. This one conjugates exactly the same as n a j e c t i v e s as you see in this summary chart here. So you simply need to apply what you have just learned. In the example of the sentence, 学生です it conjugates like this in plain form. 学生だ学生じゃない学生だった学生じゃなかった If you want to conjugate this one, I am 20 years old or someone is 20 years old, it's going to be like this in plain form. Hatachi da. Hatachi ja nai. Hatachi datta. Hatachi ja nakatta. We have covered the plain form conjugations for e adjectives, n a adjectives, Nouns and all the verb groups. Be sure to review plain past for Japanese verbs in the previous lesson. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. If you liked my lesson and are interested in my online courses, you can check them on my website, smilenihongo.com slash class. ではまた次のレッスンで会いましょう。